Welcome back guys. I'm so excited because I have so much good stuff that I have just been loving that I wanted to get on here and share with you guys. I have some fashion, some beauty, and maybe a few lifestyle things. So I'm just going to start grabbing stuff. I have been on the hunt for the perfect pair of foldover black boots and I found these ones at Zara. These are like my dream boots. Folded over so you can't tell that the heel is really short and easy to walk in. I just love how they look styled with like a skirt or a dress or anything that shows your legs. They just pull everything together and make your outfit look super intentional and ugh, I just I love these. I love the look of like a chunky dad shoe. So these are the New Balance 9060 shoes and these are just perfect for those days where I just want to be more casual. I really want to wear them to the gym too but I'm trying to keep them looking clean and i love the look of the cream with the silver they just match so many clothes that i have and are easy to throw on also from zara i've been loving this jacket Woo! i feel like this is such a good staple that i will keep for years it's like a patent leather that's really soft i just feel like this is the perfect black puffer jacket that goes with everything and is easy to throw on i like when it's open it still has that leather detail it also has that lining around the wrist and I just love it. I usually size up in my jackets, but I went with a small in this one. And it's just so cozy. Lately, I've been loving going and picking up a coffee and just browsing around Brandy Melville. I've been loving my Brandy Melville PJs. These ones I haven't worn yet, but I have been living in this cute little set. So we have the blue floral, this cute little angel print, and this dainty little rose print. I love a good self-care night where I take a bath, get out, put on my pajamas, do my skincare, put oil all over my body. It's just, I don't know, I've just been loving these. And then from Lulu, I've been living in these wide scuba sweatpants. They have a thick waistband and then they're just wide leg. I've been wearing these and washing these and they've been holding up really, really well. I also love these groove pants from Lululemon with the like a cloud bra. This is the color Java. Yeah, this has just been my favorite gym outfit. My neighbor always has their speaker so loud. I hope you can't hear it. If I edit this and I can hear them, I will make sure I ask them to just turn down their music next time. Also from Lulu, I've been loving this quilted belt bag that I wear as a crossbody. I wear this a lot to the gym or running errands. Um, Especially if you're a mom, it just makes running errands so much easier. It has a bunch of pockets. And then this one also has a little hand warmer if you live somewhere cold. Last for clothing, I just have a few pairs of pants. I feel like good American jeans are the comfiest jeans I have ever tried. A light wash that I've had for a while. And I also recently picked up this... Um, dark wash but i wanted to mention good american jeans just because they are the softest stretchiest jeans i've ever tried that are still thick and good quality i've also been loving low rise jeans this pair is from white fox they're cuffed at the bottom so your sneakers or heels just peek out of the jeans really well I just stop exactly where I want them to cover a little bit of my stomach but they're not as high as a super high rise jean that is hard to like sit in I've been loving the look of flipping my hair in and I've been using this T3 flat iron. This is the T3 Luca one and a half rapid heat iron. This heats up so quickly and I've just been loving taking it and kind of flipping the ends in. And then my favorite lip combo lately, my best friends Abby and Emily gifted me for Christmas. This is the Patrick Ta Major Volume Lip Gloss in the shade Pouty. I've just been going in without any lipstick, just the Patrick Ta She's Strong lip liner and the gloss. So that's what I have on today. I'll put some more on actually. So when you apply it, it kind of has like this icy undertone to it. And yeah, I don't even put any lipstick on, just the lip liner and gloss, and I'm good to go. A good drugstore gloss that I've been loving is from Milani in the color 08, and this is a nourishing lip plumper. And this one just has a little bit more color to it. Next, I have my House Labs foundation, and I love how it looks mixed with my Hourglass concealer. I go in, and this is the color Pearl, but I just go in and I apply the concealer on my cheeks, my forehead, and my chin and then i mix it with my foundation and this just gives such a beautiful coverage and finish it makes your skin look like you have a filter like no texture i've also been loving my refi lip liners this is the shade rosewood 
that's rosewood it's a little bit more pinky and then she's strong is more of like a brown yeah so rosewood versus she's strong my new favorite blush is from sigma and it's in the shade berry love i've just been applying it on the tops of my cheeks and on my nose and it just lasts all day oh it's just so pretty Sometimes I apply blush and then it's gone. So I like that I know whenever I wear this, it's gonna last all day. On days where I'm going to the gym and I don't want a lot of makeup, I love the look of like just glowy skin. Whenever I leave the house, I've been trying to be really good about using my sunscreen. This Instant Free sunscreen is one of my favorites to wear under makeup or just out the house. And I also have this SPF 30 sunscreen from e.l.f. But this one has a little bit of a glow to it. <laughs> And I just like how this adds a glow to my skin if I'm running errands or going to the gym. Sometimes I feel like I just need a little bit of color on my skin. I've been adding the Say Sun Glow. It just adds a really nice sheer tint of color. I have been loving this eyelash curler. It's so much easier to get in after I apply mascara. This just gets all of the lashes really easily. I just feel like it holds a curl so much better. Yeah, I just don't like the feeling of false lashes, especially since I wear contacts. So this has been helping my eyes hold a curl so much better. I don't know what I was doing before I was using a tongue scraper. Now I don't feel like I'm like ready or clean until I've scraped my tongue. I've been trying to use this even before I drink water so I don't have any bacteria in my mouth. And I've been using a coconut oil to do oil pulling. Um, I just try to swish it around for like two minutes. I don't know if anyone else has this issue, but I used to wake up with a really dry mouth and this helps a lot. It also has helped whiten my teeth. Two skincare products I've been loving. Um, first, I have the CeraVe Facial Moisturizing Lotion. This is just a really nice, affordable moisturizer. I've been wearing this during the day as well. Ceramides, niacinamide, and hyaluronic acid, and just feels so good and absorbs really easily into the skin. I was listening to a podcast with an esthetician that was saying after you wash your face or even after you shower that you should go in with bottled water and pour it all over your body or all over your skin. But I feel like keeping a spray like this is a lot easier. So after I wash my face, I go in with this Evian facial spray and it feels so amazing. This is gonna feel really good during the summer as well, but look how it just sprays out. Oh, I kinda wanna put on my skin. It just sprays out so nicely. My favorite fragrance combination at the moment is the Tom Ford Soleil Neige Shimmering Body Oil. Mixing it with Rose's Musk smells so amazing. It's one of the few floral fragrances that I enjoy. Just like a really beautiful rose scent, but not like a grandma rose. This is like a hot girl rose scent. So yeah, this is just musk, rose, and jasmine. I get such dry skin to the point where I cannot sleep sometimes unless I douse my skin in lotion and oils. My favorite moisturizer, especially in the winter when my skin's really dry, is the Palmer's um, Raw Shea Nourish Body Balm. I am almost out of it, but this just really locks in the moisture, um, especially the days leading up. I know I'm going to be self-tanning. This just this smells really good too. This is also really good anywhere that you get cracked skin, like your heels, your elbows, or your knees. You don't like full coverage and you just want glowy skin. The Maybelline Superstay 24-hour skin tint adds like a really beautiful glow without too much coverage. I like that you can still see your skin, but add some color. I feel like both of these sunglasses from Amazon look like they're designer sunglasses, and I'm pretty sure they're both under $15. So here is just a good black staple pair. And I've also been loving these like, I just love these ones too. I've also been loving this large monthly planner to just look at my month and it's not labeled. So if you wanna skip a month, you can. So yeah, those are all my current favorites. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you in the next video.